Hello YouTube. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick review of uh, new 4.4.4 ROM for Samsung Galaxy S3 i9300, which is actually a ported ROM. It's imported from the Korean Exynos Galaxy S3 LTE. Uh, the ROM is called Back to Note, and uh, we have a standalone zip file to flash the, that ROM. And this ROM is heavily deblotted, so you can't find any bloatware and all. And then it's also denoxed, so no nox is included. And if you look at the RAM usage, if you clear the raw memory. It takes actually less RAM. For me, at the first time, it was like uh, 400, 450 range, and the overall performance is increased. Responsiveness is increased because it uses less RAM, and the interface is stock only. All the interfaces are stock. Not much difference from them. And you can see the uh, status bar is in icons are in white color. That's the main difference, as you can see. And then in call error we have uh, call recording option, so we can record the calls. And then there is a, a direct call option, which helps to make I think the video call or something. So you can switch camera, hide me. So it's video call feature, I think. CMF and also here also we can directly uh, send message from here it will directly send message it's nice and the browser comes with uh, a feature called image image on feature ok that's the main dif difference I see If you look at the notification bar, eh? there are different kinds of NFC modes, the NFC card mode, and uh, R bar W peer to peer. So there are different kinds of modes there. And then uh, in data, it, it automatically defines that uh, I'm roaming, so it shows a data roaming option. And uh, if you go to the settings options. The main feature is like uh, they include the wireless printing support here. And then uh, in accessibility options, they included CC support like Google Subtitle and Samsung support. CC means uh, closed to caption support. And the Samsung applications are updated like we have a uh, Samsung apps. Galaxy App Store is this and then uh, Galaxy Essential is here and then if you look at the camera options we can actually turn off turn on the camera from here shutter, shutter sound is here actually the shutter sound is here you can turn it off and then we have And then we have a uh, full screen lock screen album art as you can see. And overall there are many uh, general stability improvements and also many small small tweaks are there. Um, that's it. You can see a, a, description, a video below which shows how to install this ROM. Please have a look at it. That's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more.